Hey guys, what is going on? Okay, so today we're gonna do round two of the do or the do not. I've got everything laid out pretty much exactly where we stopped. And we're gonna give this a go. Still gonna stay on the same systems. Still gonna stay on pretty much everything we have been doing. So we're just gonna kind of pick up right where we left off. Uh, we have that count for the do, the count for the don't. I have the extra camera. I'll go ahead and start it when we get going here to capture the landing zone. Um, guys, want to say I love you guys. Thank you for being here. Let's get this done. Let's finish this up. See who wins this up, and then maybe we can. I'm gonna ask suggestions. What are other systems uh, you think uh, we should do a head-to-head -head battle on? I would love to do some head-to-head -head battles. So, what do you think we should do a head-to-head? -head? What are your suggestions? I love you guys. Let's do this. Okay, guys. Good, the dice. What we're gonna do, uh, let me go ahead and get this back in the rack. And see how we end up today. Let's finish this up. Hope you guys are doing well. I miss you guys. Now, I know the dump boy is hurting pretty bad, but you know how things happen. It, it can turn around. It can turn around, go from good to bad, in one way or another, uh, for anybody, in a second. You just never know. So I've got the line going on the do. Let me get the don't going for the don't. What I'm going to do is go ahead and get some change also while I'm at it. I'm going to get two green. Let me get some change here. Okay. There we go. Verify that it is 25. That looks good. Good to me. Let's get some more change over here. Put some greens over here. Okay, you got the change. 50 going up in the rack. All right, we have the don't pass laid. Odds are on the table. Let's do it. I'm gonna stay with one times odds for now. We'll see what happens. Uh, something I was thinking about the other day though, in that I was doing the controlled random. What I am going to do is just swap to random. Just a jiggle and a go, we, out we go. And that's a come out seven. Six, one, seven. The don'ts. Goes away. Bringing down the combats for the don'ts. The odds. Oh. The odds get returned. And the don'ts get one to one on the flat. On that come out. So that's help on that don't. And now his stack looks much better. Gonna go ahead and get back up on the don't pass. Gonna do the same. Yeah. The odds get returned. The flat bets go away. And the line gets one to one. Okay, here we go. Okay, we have a hard ten. Hard ten is going to be the point. All right, let's get the bets placed. The DC is up. Uh, we'll do one times odds. There we go. Uh, the C. Is up. And again, we'll do one times odds. All right, here we go. Let's do this. That's a three, two, five. Five goes up. I'll go ahead and place the odds. That's going to be two times odds. One, two, three. DC goes up. What I'll do is 21 times odds. Or 21 for the two times odds for this. Oh. There we go. Just 
just so you guys see. Five. Five. All right, we're set. Uh, need to get the uh, comes back up. Okay, we went. Gonna do a three point Molly style, so we have three points going at all times. Oh, landmine. That's a two one three. The combat goes away. Tell you what, you gotta watch those landmines. They will get you. Oh, it turned. Now the DC gets quick pay. All right. We have a six, two, eight. Hope you guys are doing well. Make sure you can see that. DC goes up. We'll do three times odds. So I've got 10, 20, 30. Well, ah, five two seven. There we go. Just like that, guys. Things can turn around for those don't players. You know, in my last video, I think I dropped a, a pretty hard statement on a, the DC, the don't come players, and and the don't players. Guys, I'm sorry if they came out um, a bit crazy or a bit, uh, you know, um, I'm sorry if that came out wrong because that's not, I didn't mean for that to be a, such a harsh statement that I think it was. Uh, when I said, don't bet on me if you don't, uh, no ill intent meant. Okay, so I'm going to do these one at a time. So. Five, I have 21, that's gonna pay 14. So one to one for the flat and 14 for the back end. Then four. So there's the five and the eight is gonna get five for every six. I've got 30 on the back, so that's five uh, times six, so will be 25. There's the don't pay for the, that eight. And now the DC. Make sure to get some more reds here. One to one on the flat. Here are the odds. Gets half. One for every two on the odds. So, that's a nice little payday for the DC shooter. That's a really nice payday for the DC shooter. His rack has become quite full. Now um, I'm thinking uh, all this will go away. And that's, you know, going back to what I was uh, saying before, things can turn in an instant. Do not go on tilt. Do not get frustrated. Don't change your game plan. Just ride the waves. So back on the do. And up on the don't. Okay, so what I'm going to do is go to stick left one. Go around the table here. All right, here we go. Control random. Uh, kind of random. Well, that was far. We have a three, one, four. Four is going to be the point. I love doing these head-to-head -head betting styles. It's a lot of fun doing it. Really enjoy it. Three, one, four. 
get up on the DC. I'm gonna do one times odds. Now, if I were in the casino, what would I do more than one times odds? Absolutely. Uh, but we're just doing this just because. Okay. That's a three, one, four. Frontline winner on that four. Uh, the DC will move up to the four. Point comes off. And the don't come, or the don't pass bar goes away. Going back up on the don't pass. Come, we'll go up to the four. Not gonna place any uh, odds yet because it's come out one to one on the flat bet, two to one on the back end. That was better. Jeez, six three nine. Do two times odds. Six three nine. Let's see how there we go. Okay, and again we'll do twenty one two times odds. Okay, up on the DC, we need to get our one times odds on the 10 and 4. One times odds on the 10 and 4. All right. Board is set. Dice out. Let's do it. Oh, 5 4 9. Frontline winner. 5 4 9. 9 9 Nina. DC goes up. Okay, this is gone. Replace it back. And just because, I'll go ahead and do it. Although, of course, they're not working, but since we're right here, might as well. Okay. Got that. Got that. Come goes up. Point is off. Let's pay these. The point was nine. So it's going to be one to one in front. And one for every two or three for every three for every. Oh my gosh, I all of a sudden just had a brain fart. I can't remember how to say the odds. It's one and a half. I guess three for every three for every two. Yeah, three for every two, one and a half. So odds are right. Right, guys, a little brain fart there. Might as well get the odds going here as well. Not active, but at least replaced. A come out seven is rolled. Jeeps. Come out seven. Okay, let's get these two. And the bet and the odds. The flat bets get one to one, so one to one. And the odds get returned. Ooh. Whoa, we have a chip dome. Okay. Uh, the don't pass bar goes away on that come out. So let's put that back. I can tell you one thing, the don't pass, he's made a, a substantial comeback. Let's see, come out roll. Okay, here we go. Odds get returned. Flat bets go to the bank. 
and the line gets one to one. All right, let's make a point. Well, boxcar for the don't pass bar. Boxcar is a push. We don't win it, we don't lose it. For the pass line on the come out, goes away. Five one six. Four two six. That's a front line winner six. Back to back sixes, baby. Right at the right time. Well, right time for the do's. Uh, bad time for the don'ts, of course. And ultimately, uh, going back to what was said in the uh, previous video, um, when it saw the, when I was inadvertently slamming the the DC players. Um, again, I apologize about that. Uh, the don't pass bar goes away. Uh, getting back on that DC. Or don't pass. Um, it all comes down to what you're most comfortable with, you know. Um, I remember sp talking with uh, Ryan Vander Hayden, and one of the things that he would say was that it never failed. The casino where he goes to, it just never fails. Um, let's see, and with thirty on the back end, it's going to be six dollars. I paid that wrong the other day. I'm going to forget to do that properly this time. Um, when I spoke to Ryan Van Der Heden, he, he said that it's just the coldest casino in the history of all casinos. And I'm sure that we all have been to tables or casinos like that in the past, where it's just cold, constant seven ounce for, for people playing. And you have to learn uh, it's a four three seven. Come out seven. You have to learn how to adapt. Uh, sometimes things get hot, and um, you have to be able to recognize that and play on the on on the side of the dues. But other times that it's just absolutely ice cold. Flat bet goes away, or gets paid. Excuse me. Flat bet on the DC gets paid. One to one. We had no odds out there to be returned. And don't pass, goes away. Uh, but but understanding that this goes away, and yeah, it's just pretty much just one for one there. To understand that uh, you you have to have the ability to see what's going on. Um, when the tides change, do you have to go from you know? From playing the dues and swap over to the dark sides in the middle of a session it's very possible and <laughs> it's not always the, the fun thing to do but that's what we're out there to find out uh, that's kind of what we're, we're doing right now is to learn how to play the table oh i forgot to put the dc out there or the don't pass and the don't pass goes away Going back up on the don't pass. It's a come out seven, by the way. And the pass line gets one to one on the come out with that seven. Hard six. We're dead. Point goes to the six. Whoop. And the don't come gets placed. I forgot the odds. He needs um, $30 in odds. 
Uh, Tom goes up. Thirty. I'll place that. But he, okay, just know thirty dollars in odds for the don't pass. Four one five. DC goes up to the five. Make it thirty out there. Twenty-five and thirty. I'm gonna clean this up. Make sure. Twenty-five, thirty. Uh, let's see, 21 in odds. And then five. And back up on that D DC. 415. In odds. All right, here we go. Four two six front line winner. The don't pass comes down. Guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead and call it. Guys, this time I think it's pretty clear. Um, this round, this session, I mean, even if I were to take everything off the table for the DC, which I cannot because of the contract, but still, I, I know the DC was getting up there again. That's what the DC guy has in his rack. Forty-five, fifty, fifty-one, and I'll, I won't count it. I mean, I don't really see what the need is. That's what the the con player has in his uh, his stack. Not to mention, of course, what he has on the table as well. Um, guys, I think uh, in this example, I think it's pretty clear who uh, takes this challenge. And although I'm not going to diss it, I'm not downing the don't come players. It depends on the casino. It depends on the players. It depends on the mood and how the table is going. I get that. I totally get that. In this challenge, the come player wins. The don't come player obviously is the loser in this one. But next time, let's do some more comparisons. I want to do the Iron Cross versus a, I like to call it the Bone Thrower, the Bone Thrower SOR, like a four shot SOR, up and down. Um, I would like to do that. Uh, what do you guys think? Today, the come player wins. That's, that's my story and I'm sticking to it. I love you guys. I hope you guys are well. Happy 4th of July. Have a great day. CP is out.